Good afternoon, everyone. Um, first of all, thank you very much for joining today. Uh, I know it's very hard to find the time during the working hours, uh, you know, but uh, rest assured, me and Vanessa is going to make this uh, webinar as interesting as possible and also give you some really good nuggets that how you can grow uh, your business, uh, you know, on TikTok uh, with the help of Avisan. So before we dive in, can I'm just going to enable the chat. Can you just confirm that you all can hear us? Can you all hear us okay? If someone can just put a message on a chat, please, that would be great. This is my microphone as well, just to make sure. Muskan, you can hear us as well. Thank okay. you, Katya. Debbie, okay. thank you. Perfect, perfect. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, appreciate that. So uh, my name is Tejas. I'm the founder and CEO of Avasam and eBusiness Guru. As you can see, I'm in the e-commerce industry for the last 20 years, where I got an opportunity to work with thousands of uh, you know, the sellers and help them with their e-commerce journey, marketplace journey, you know, multi-channel strategy journey, and now with the social commerce journey as well. And today, uh, me and Vanessa is going to go through in detail how you can make your dropshipping journey uh, also successful on TikTok using Avisam. So that's me, over to you, Vanessa. Hi, everybody. Um, as Tejas said, thank you, Tejas, for that introduction. My name is Vanessa. I am a social media and digital content creator, both, both personally and professionally. Um, so he, he labeled me as a TikTok expert, UGC creator and presenter. Uh, so what we'll go into in the next, you know, coming slides will give you a bit more of an idea of what I do. But I've just been in and around the social media game since social media started. Okay, that might be showing my age. Um, so I have been an avid user and now really just gearing towards that professional e-commerce space and social selling and all of that sort of thing, which we'll get into shortly. But uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> Exciting. Brilliant. Thank you, Vanessa. So let's look at what we got in our agenda. So what you will see here, there are three key areas which we are going to cover. Uh, the first one is social selling on uh, TikTok shop. Uh, how you can do that. So Vanessa will go in detail with you. Uh, then the second is what are the products which are trending right now on TikTok and how you can find those products on Amazon and uh, make a profit. So that will be the second area which we are going to cover. And the last is what are the key benefits you will get when you work with Amazon and TikTok shop together? Uh, and uh, of course, at the end, we will have a Q&A. So altogether, there are 42 slides and we are trying to cover that in less than 40 minutes. So you will have time uh, to ask the questions. So without uh, wasting much time, I'm going to move to the next uh, slide where we are going to introduce uh, Avisam. So what is Avisam? If some of you which you are not aware of, Avisam is an award-winning multi-channel dropshipping platform and marketplace. Uh, we are just under five years old now. Um, what Amazon does uh, is mainly uh, virtually connects the, the brand owners, distributors, manufacturers, wholesalers with the online retailers, the marketplace sellers, social commerce uh, sellers as well, uh, and help them to source and sell uh, verified inventory uh, from the local suppliers. Um, where the, we have uh, Amazon offers multiple packages starting from $19.99 and it goes up to $149.99. It depends on your journey, where you are. You can select the package which suits your requirement. The key thing what Amazon offers is the automation, starting from the sourcing of the products, listing of the products, also uh, order management, order shipping, and the customer service part as well. What we've been feeling proud about, and if you see our Trustpilot reviews as well, that 
the platform what we have built is for our customers, is our sellers and the suppliers, and they are finding it very easy to use. And with the monthly promotions, which we are running it, it's helping our sellers to scale faster than ever before. We do offer one-to-one -one account management service as well, where we offer the special products and also guidance as well that how they should run their dropshipping business and scale the business as well on a selected subscription package. You can see here, we have official partnerships with the uh, majority of the leading e-commerce players, including TikTok, Shopify, eBay, uh, Ecamm, BigCommerce as well. Uh, we have over 200,000 SKUs available from the UK-based supplier. This is very, very important. And we will get into detail that why the UK-based inventory is important when you are selling on TikTok. So let's move to the first chapter of today's discussion, social selling on TikTok shop. So over to you, Vanessa. Thank you, Tejas. Okay, so why TikTok shop? So for those of you who are just joining, I'm sure you're completely aware now that the TikTok shop is the up and coming e-commerce platform mixed with social selling, okay? It's on a social media platform. So as you can see here by the stats, it says TikTok's the fastest growing app with 4.6 billion people expected on TikTok by 2026. No surprises there. Uh, with the Influence superpower. It says 71% of the audience enjoys shopping after seeing something on feeds, live, etc. And then, of course, building brand awareness. 70% of TikTokers stated that they found new goods on the platform, making in-app purchasing crucial for brands, which is, again, the way of the future. Uh, we talked about this at some other meetings that we've had in the past where we noticed anyways that... Um, other other markets in in the world at the moment are already very much familiar with social selling, uh, TikTok shop and the like. And now we're getting Europe and North America on board, which is so exciting. It is um, an incredible time in this in this world that we're right at the precipice, right at the the baseline of really building this e commerce platform in these markets. So if you are joining here today. Thank you so much. Welcome. Um, and then I know I can click next myself, can't I? Okay, so marketplaces sold convenience. Now the consumers desire a deeper connection, right? So everybody got very familiar with the convenience of, you know, e-commerce, uh, Amazon, eBay, and the like. And now people are wanting a little bit more. They want that deeper connection where, you know, they are watching their favorite creators or maybe even their friends and families who are posting on the app. They're wanting their firsthand recollection, firsthand testimonials of products, right? Um, they're there's a famous saying that I love where it's like you buy when you know, like and trust from somebody. That's that's what you that's what will build that connection for you to actually create a purchase. So now, you know, we know the convenience of the e-commerce space, but now we want it to be a bit more personalized. So that's where the TikTok shop comes into play. Uh, hashtag the TikTok gateway, the gateway to a new kind of consumer experience. What began as a curiosity became a revelation, a revelation that shopping is isn't just about products, but it's about the stories and shared moments behind them. So that's exactly it, right? The word of mouth um, selling model is probably by far the uh, biggest kind of um, thing that, that people go for, right? If somebody that you know, like, and trust recommends to you a product, you're more than likely uh, to purchase it. So that's what the uh, TikTok shop is uh, allowing people to do and giving everybody a baseline to do that, regardless of if you're a big time creator or even just, you know, using the app recreationally as well. Okay, so I love this little um, slide here because basically what it's saying now, it's not just e-commerce, it's social commerce, it's discovery commerce, it's community commerce, and it's conversational commerce. So let that sit in for you guys. Okay, so as we've been talking about, TikTok is the new storefront for customers. They're, you're looking at 39% of purchases now are, are, are coming from 
things that you saw on TikTok, right? You see leading the way family and friend recommendation or seeing a family member using a product like we were just talking about. So now we have TikTok shop where, again, you have that convenience like you do with e-commerce platforms like Amazon, eBay, and so on and so forth. But now you have that social aspect as well. So it's the combination of the two, which is, it just gets me so excited, guys. And I hope you're excited as well. All right, so the four C's of TikTok purchasing force. You see culture coming into place with the creator, the content, and the community all coming into one. That is the power of a TikTok shop, okay? Um, and again, this can you know be aware for big big time creators or again the uh, users that are just using it recreationally on the platform, um, which is very powerful. So how to TikTok, think like a marker, but act like a creator. This is where we get super creative, guys. Um, we're looking into what the TikTok audience wants, okay? So what they want to see from a brand, all right? You have 57% wanting those promos, those deals, okay? You are seeing on TikTok because it is a newer e-commerce platform, you are starting to see um, people getting really excited about the, the promos, the flash sales, the deals, et cetera. And that's kind of giving that urgency and that um, incentive for people who have never purchased on the platform before to start purchasing. Um, and then of course you have 42% wanting giveaways and contests. A lot of brands are now taking advantage of these, you know, live sessions to do giveaways and different contests, again, to build that brand recognition and that um, trust with their audience, um, getting the product in front of as many people as possible, both on the app and, you know, in people's hands, um, doing these giveaways is a really good way to establish a, a, a good authority. Um, and so, of course, you're looking at almost dead even on the bottom is you have um, brands doing trends and challenges, doing announcements and product reveals, tutorials and how to, and then, of course, special events. So those ones kind of make fit almost 50 percent just in equal chunks there because um, these are all quite important. You have to have a bit of a versatile approach when you are building your brand on the uh, TikTok um, platform. Okay. Um, so it's been an amazing journey with what we've been doing so far here with uh, Avasam e-business e guru, just, you know, building um, d different TikTok um shops for different brands. It's been a, a very big learning curve and we're just excited to be able to share with you guys what that looks like really. So we said here the greatest tactic to date in our opinion according to recommendations from TikTok is to hype up the flash sale on the TikTok post or live sale. Again, you are wanting to build that momentum in the beginning when you are building your brand because nobody on the platform will know who you are straight off the gate unless again you're like a really, really popular, well-known own brand uh, that's coming into the space. But for right now, that's what uh, we're seeing the most kind of success in there. Um, and, you know, just creating a lot of storytelling announcements and things like that. Um, building, you know, when somebody wants to purchase a product, you want them to go to their page and go, wow, I trust this pro this brand because look at all of these amazing videos they they've posted. They want to know that you're real. They want to know that they can trust you. Okay. Yeah. So I just want to step in here. That uh, what uh, Vanessa is saying here, that you need to be as authentic as you can, because yeah. that's what people love. And, and another thing, what she's highlighting here, that, you know, who is going to buy on TikTok? The people are sitting on the couch, right? Now, what will make them to, you know, come out of their couch and make a play and place an order? Right. For that, you need to actually offer something very special. And, and that's why having a flash sales, promos, giveaways are a key, key strategy, uh, are important, you know, the variables which you can consider, um, you know, so wh whatever she's saying, this is based on the experience. What we are seeing that when you have this, this will help you uh, yeah. to, to grab the sale. Yeah, it gives an extra incentive for sure. And especially uh, because, you know, a lot of brands and sellers are coming to the platform. Um, you know, you need to kind of give that little bit of a competitive edge and a bit of an incentive and excitement and momentum in your uh, TikTok shop, for sure. Thank you, Tejas. Ooh. 
All right, so how to sell products on TikTok. There are four different ways, okay? So as you can see here in the lists provided, you have live shopping. So this is when you are scrolling your For You page and you come across a live stream. Uh, many of you guys are very familiar with that, I'm sure. And you can actually tap into the live uh, screen, the live stream, and the seller, the presenter, will be selling, doing a broadcast from wherever they are, whether it's a studio, their home, etc., from their smartphone, uh, or maybe they, you know, have over a thousand followers, and then they have the entire studio set up, which is great as well. But in essence, it's like live uh, social uh, buying. Basically, it's kind of similar to the. It's an equivalent to, I guess, as seen on TV, QVC, etc., except it's in your app, it's on your phone, and you can just scroll through, and you'll encounter many brands doing so. So people can purchase directly through the live stream. When you're hosting a live stream, obviously, you'll see um, people linking products that the buyers can just click and they can just purchase right there and then. And then of course you have your in-feed videos, which again, you're scrolling through your For You page, you come across a video, it might be an ad, it might just be organic. In our cases, we've been doing a lot of organic with a little bit of ads here and there. Um, but in essence, it's just a video that is tagged uh, the product that you can purchase right in that video. And then of course you have your product showcase. So in that screen there, you're looking, this is the third screen we're looking at. You're seeing an actual TikTok account and you'll see that they have an actual uh, product showcase. They have their own TikTok shop as it were for that brand. And so when you go to that TikTok account and look at all of their videos, you can actually click on the little shopping bag and their TikTok shop with all of their products, their whole product showcase will be there, right? And then the last uh, little screen there, as you can see, this is your shop tab. So this is very much like your uh, marketplace. So when you open up your app yourself, you're not looking at anybody's accounts, you're just looking on your own screen. And at the bottom, it's going to have a little shopping uh, tab and it's going to open up the marketplace. Again, very similar to Amazon or eBay where you type in, I want to get, you know, an air fryer or I need um, pore strips for my nose or whatever the case is, or I need a chandelier. Like you just type it in and it will show up a ton of different, uh, you know, sellers and brands, etc., all selling that uh, item. So that is the four ways that people can sell slash purchase on TikTok. And then we'll just kind of dive in. So obviously we talked a little bit about this, but I just wanted to show you in real time, you're shopping during the TikTok live, you tap and you literally just go to the transaction. So you can see there in the, in the screen, in the iPad, you can see it's a three in one juicer blender and grinder set. The person can literally click buy and it will take them to that screen just on the left hand side where you are um, requested to put in your shipping details, uh, your card payments. You know, a lot of sellers will take Apple Pay, credit debit card, Klarna, ClearPay, etc. And then the person is just able to buy direct there and then. Another way that you can shop during the live session is if you look at the bottom left hand side of the, the tablet screen there, you'll see a little orangey yellow ba bag that says shop with a little number on top. That is how many products that you have purposely ha uh, added to your live show. So that way, you know, if you're if you're talking about these nine products, you can easily pin it to your screen like you see at the bottom there. So obviously we have our, our presenter, Velissa here. She's talking about the three in one juicer blender and grinder set. So what she's done is she's taken out of the nine products that we've added to that live stream. She simply pinned that one product as she's talking about it. So that way the audience can go, OK, I want that. And they don't even have to go through the shopping bag and look through all of the products that we have available. They can literally just one tap purchase easy peasy lemon squeezy. And then of course, if you want to see you, you, what I often do when I'm on TikTok live is I often say, guys, you know, whilst I'm talking about this product, like, please feel free to take a look at the other products we have. Let me know which one you want to see. Just give me the number of the product that you want to see and I'll feature it for you and I'll pin it for you, etc. Just giving your audience a little bit of that autonomy to look and see what other products you have whilst you're 
focusing in on one out of your nine, 10, 90, who knows, right? So that's the way in which we uh, recommend doing the TikTok lives. Um, the lives is as well are very, very repetitive. If you've ever seen a TikTok live shopping channel before, it's so funny. If you sat there for the entire one hour, two hour, seven hour stream, I don't know, maybe, maybe you watched a TikTok all day. Um, but you know, you'll see it's very repetitive because people are coming in and out, in and out, in and out. So a lot of it will be like, hi, guys, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We are XYZ brand. We're offering XYZ offer. Make sure you're double tapping your screen to give us some likes. Share with your friends and family. Blah, 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 blah. Make sure you follow XYZ brand. It's very repetitive. But honestly, guys, it works. And in our experience with the TikTok lives, it's such a pertinent part of building your brand from the ground up on TikTok because it's exposing your brand to so many many different audiences. And in on in all honesty, we've been pumping out like hundreds of videos per month. And the most amount of our followers are still coming from the TikTok lives because TikTok themselves are really, really pushing live content um, and prioritizing live content. So if you're not going live as much as possible, then that's that's an issue. So again, the in-feed videos, just going back to uh, what we were talking about just now, is that, of course, you want to be creating an abundance of content on your TikTok account for your TikTok shop that will obviously provide a bit more context to your brand, showing the how-tos, what you offer, you know, different creative organic content to really, you know, illustrate that you are a brand that is trustworthy um, and, you know, just building that community with the followers you gain from your live, the followers you've gained from these videos, etc. And again, you can shop uh, every time you uh, post a video of one of your products Products, you should be in theory um, tagging those products so that way if it shows up on somebody's for you page they can automatically purchase whatever product you're talking about in the exact same format that they did in the TikTok live shows okay so again you can literally just click it you see it circled there in the first screen you click it it pops up you can say add to basket or buy now again brings you to that exact same screen shipping details payment methods etc etc it has never been easier so that's that's very self-explanatory. Um, but the 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 thing that I want to hammer home is that uh, you need to create an abundance of content um, to really get your brand built, building momentum and building trust within your audience. Anything you want to add, Tejas, with that? No, I think you're spot on. Uh, I think these are the in video, the infant video is the exercise which you do. Uh, to create the brand awareness, uh, yes. it will not it will not help you to generate the revenue on on get go. But the more more you do, uh, the better your brand awareness is going to be. So, For sure. uh, so I think these are the uh, what we are referring here is these are the foundations uh, yes. which you need to have in place in order to be successful on TikTok. For sure. And just to add to that quickly before we go, uh, we move on is with these in feed v videos, what we're finding anyways, especially in 2024, the algorithm is quite different. It's always evolving, always maturing. What we're noticing anyway, is that videos that will have we have created maybe a month or two ago will now start to pick up on the views, will now start to create the rent revenue and the followership, etc. So it's a really cool way in which, you know, you might have posted something a year ago and it'll pop off this month and it'll start creating revenue so it is a really like a long game but it's cool because you have your videos there for an extended period of time which is great uh, okay so then the product showcase so these are the items that are listed on your profile page as we discussed um, and again once you've built the foundation with doing several lives you know to build that momentum you're creating content consistently you're building brand awareness on your page um, now the more more you've done this and the more of a foundation you've built, people are more likely, especially if they follow you, to purchase directly through your product page itself, especially if they've started following you. Okay. So that's what I would say about that. And then 
what I would say about the shop tab is, again, if you've built that foundation with your lives and your in-feed videos, what you'll notice is that majority of your sales will eventually come from this, from the shop tab, because what will happen is over time, the more um, you know, you've built up that foundation and that followership and that trust, you're, you're getting people to purchase, they'll start making reviews, they might, they might even start making content on their own pages and tagging your, your account and sharing with their audiences, et cetera. And over time with really good SEO, really good brand awareness and a good foundation, you will start to see a lot of the uh, sales coming directly from the shop tab, people looking for whatever it is that you're selling and that, you know, with good SEO and a good kind of review base and shop, um, uh, Rating. What's the word? Shop rating. Thank you, Tejas. Then you will start to see more of those uh, sales come through on that side. So it's all very cumulative and it's it's a long game, but it is the most exciting thing. Uh, once you start to see an account grow, it's just it's beyond exciting. Yeah. Um, I just want to add here uh, on, on the shop tab uh, part that the shop tab uh, module been launched by TikTok uh, just just four months ago. So it's still in its uh, early days. But the one who is already selling online on eBay, Amazon, or on their websites, they can, I mean, they can relate this. This is no different than what you do on eBay and Amazon. Um, however, this is slightly different where uh, on eBay and Amazon, we put the product, we stick the products, put that marketing budget, and the product starts selling. What Vanessa is saying here that you do that uh, here anyway, but on top of that, the three other areas, what, what has been highlighted, all those needs to be done in order to ramp up the sales uh, sure. on, on your uh, TikTok uh, account. And, uh, and like, uh, like any, any other places, when you sell, people are looking for the reviews, they want to see how trustworthy you are. So all those things, small things matters. Um, but someone has to start at some place. So sooner you do, um, you can raise better. We have also seen the competition uh, is building up uh, every uh, every month. Uh, and But it is exciting. I think uh, it gives e everyone equal opportunity, not like Amazon and eBay, where you've been seen in front of 10 other competition here. By having your own creative content, uh, it will allow you to stand out uh, in your audience. So uh definitely i think this uh, what what you see here is very very powerful and and one should take the advantage of it as soon as possible as soon as possible aka yesterday as soon as possible guys <laughs> <laughs> get on or don't but get on for sure so then we have uh, get, getting started on tiktok shop so we can go towards the next one and yeah. Uh, did you want me to go into this or did you want to, Tejas? Yeah, I, I can do that uh, here. So basically, uh, if you haven't got a, a TikTok uh, shop account, then these are the four steps. So you are familiar with, uh, uh, you know, if you are familiar with selling on any other marketplace, this is no different. Whether you have to open your seller account, you have to verify you um, and your business. Uh, and once you provide all the details, they will open uh, the account. When you sell on TikTok, there are two accounts needed. One is the seller account, which is a TikTok shop account, and one is a TikTok account. And then you need to connect your TikTok shop account, which is tiktok.com, your seller account, marketing account, with your shop account. Uh, so that's how the process works. Now, we also put the checklist together. So these are the documents which we think, or the strategy, or the things which you should consider when you are onboarding yourself on TikTok. So some of the things are a standard things like your company, uh, if you're a limited company, your VAT certificate, brand authorization. If you're selling someone else's brand, it is good to have that, uh, or if it is your own brand, it's good to actually upload that brand authorization document or any other brand assets which are associated to it. So to provide that, so then TikTok knows that you are authorized seller or distributor or the brand. So then they can give you a, a good, equal importance. Product data set, this is linked with the SEO point, what Vanessa mentioned earlier that, um, I mean, selling, I mean, how are you gonna stand out against the millions of products? So they have a very strict uh, 
uh, guidelines. And if you follow that, then automatically they select your products to promote right uh, to their user base. So always work on a right uh, product data set, make sure all the informations are there. And, and then uh, see the magic. Um, always find out what are the USPs. Um, and, and, and is there any guidelines uh, TikTok offers? Because, you know, one, one interesting thing, what we found that TikTok does have sometimes a category wise, subcategory wise restrictions as well, or they would like to be, they would like to demonstrate the information in, products in a certain way. So do check if there is any guidelines are there, or uh, if there is no specific guidelines that you identify what are the USPs of that product and see that how you can, uh, so product samples for content creation. So if you don't own the product and, and let's say you are doing a drop shipping from, from uh, Avisam uh, marketplace, then in those scenarios, do buy a sample for yourself, you know, create the content because without having a product with you, uh, how are you going to create the video uh, effectively? Now, there are ways where you can create the video using a green screen, but it is not going to be as authentic as uh, having a real product. So we do recommend that you should consider doing that. List of competitors. Uh, we always recommend that uh, whatever the products you like to sell, know who else is selling at what price, what strategy is working for them. So then that helps you to to actually define your price point or how you're gonna stand out against the competition. Price comparison across the platforms, we think that is also very important. Now, customers do like to you know, check what, are the, the, what price this product is available on other established platforms. So just make sure that uh, you, you, we don't want you to go over or under, but as long as it's competitive, then it's going to be powerful. And list of hero products. This is again, very important. Uh, identify uh, from the uh, supplier or provider like Avisam, what are the hero products, what sells? Focus on those and that will help you to get faster sales. Then basically here we have highlighted the link that if you don't have a seller account, then you should, uh, you can open the seller account using this link. The moment you actually open the account using this link, you will get uh, VVIP service. What it means that the UK based TikTok customer service team will pick up your account and will help you to, uh, for a smooth onboarding. Uh, and there are standard uh, steps. Once your accounts get open, you can upload the products. Uh, and, and once you start getting the orders, you can actually manage the orders and also the shipments as well. There is a point related to affiliates, which I guess is the next slide, which I will ask Vanessa to cover. Vanessa, over to you. Sure, yeah. So there are uh, three different ways that you can leverage the affiliate program. You have a shop plan, an open plan, and a target plan. So your shop plan is basically all of the items from the seller. It allows you to, you know, just uh, maintain a, 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 a a com consistent commission uh, across all of your items. Whereas you have the open plan, which is visible to all creators who are qualified for affiliate. So there comes a point as a creator where uh, TikTok invites you to start selling as well. Um, so they'll allow you to actually, you know, link products to your, your page and, you know, you can get a commission for it. Uh, so it says creators interested in products will apply. So if myself as a creator want to sell a greens powder that I really like. I can contact the seller. I can ask for a free sample. They'll look at my account. They'll say yes or no, and uh, they'll either approve it or not. And then I, as the creator, have to actually post within 14 days of receiving the item, a video or going live for 10 minutes at a time. So that's going to be for your selected products um, with a specific commission rate. So I, as the creator, can actually see what the commission rate is for that. Um, so obviously that's available. Uh, creator visibility is for all creators, but again, you have, you as the seller can either say yes or no, which is great. Um, and then the benefits of that, it allows you to display your hot selling products on the product selection marketplace, and you can set higher commission um, rates than just the shop plan and all creators can help you promote them. We had one um, different, we have one brand where we had three products of theirs on an open plan and we had like 54 different creators making videos for it. Um, and it was just, it was interesting. Like it was, it, yeah, it, it was just something that 
you don't really have to leverage a lot of your own time for you're outsourcing essentially with your with affiliate programs you're outsourcing some of that content creation and you're leveraging their uh, the affiliates different audiences etc now a target plan is great because it allows you to invite targeted creators to promote the products for you so of course if you have a very specific kind of product that you only want a select amount of content creators to make um, uh, content for, what you can do is you can leverage with TikTok. What they'll do is they'll select, uh, they'll help you get in contact basically with these creators to do that. So it's a selected products from the seller. The commission rate is specific commission rate. So oftentimes this is where you have negotiations with a, a content creator. You'll have some content creators. Um, when we went to the TikTok uh, event, the Ramadan event last month, what we noticed was there were a lot of content creators where they're like, oh, because we have such an established brand, et cetera, I only make uh, videos for obviously products that I really genuinely love. And if I really genuinely love them and I actually make a video for you, I expect 20 to 30 percent commission etc. So it is sometimes higher. That's where those negotiations happen. So the benefits of that, obviously, targeted plans allows you to invite and co cooperate with your targeted creators who can help promote your products. Okay, so this is very specific. So the shop plan is kind of like a free for all. And then the open plan is kind of like an in between. And then your target plan is very specific. All right. Thank you, uh, Vanessa. So moving on, get started. Now, what we are saying here that sourcing top trending products with Eversum, which is the second section of the uh, of this webinar, where what we would like to offer here is some really good information that what kind of products you should source, right? And how you should, uh, how you should sell these products as well. And there are reasons as well, which we have offered, so that will help you to define your own strategy to selling those products. So what we are saying, um, to source the products uh, from Amazon, there are three options. Uh, so first thing, we would like you to sign up uh, as a free account. So it gives you an idea that what sort of inventory is there. Once you think this is the right inventory for you, uh, then you can subscribe for uh, one of the package and, and, and identify the inventory. Uh, we do have a AI enabled module as well that will help you to optimize your listings as well and also allows you to list the products directly from Amazon uh, to TikTok uh, as well. Now, every week we we provide uh, trending products. We also provide uh, you know, the information about the, the new suppliers, also the trending suppliers. So here, what you will see, some of the suppliers who are doing, either they are new or doing really well on, uh, on a TikTok. So we would like you to you know, check the, uh, check the home page, check the control panel on a regular basis and see what are the new supplies, what are the trending products and see how you can take the advantage of it. Now here you can see here, it's a, when we work across 17 different categories and you will find that nearly eight or nine categories are in front of you, but there are many more other suppliers out there which you can pick and choose based on your test and interest as well. Now, this is very interesting. So again, we we actually worked on our 2023 data to see that in which categories the customers are 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 sourcing the products from our sound and selling it. Now, what you will find that nearly 60% is people are selling from home and garden. Now you are saying, oh, it does it mean that you are just focusing on home and garden? Now the reality is that if you go to Amazon as well or eBay as well, this is what you will find. Home and garden is the the you know, the top category with any marketplace. So this is no different. But what we are seeing with with uh, TikTok is the number one category is fashion. The number two category is beauty. And number three is home and garden, right? So we do have the, uh, the inventory available under the fashion category, also on the beauty category as well, but also on a home and garden. So this gives you an idea that, you know, the, the total spectrum that, okay, where, I mean, what are the options available, how customers are selling it, how they are able to maximize their profit. And from that, you can make a decision that, okay, which categories you should focus on. And again, what you will find here is for the last 12 months in each category, how the sales has been uh, you know, divided, where you will see pretty much 
up to 50% is going to be open garden. And then depends on the time of the year, if it is a Christmas or Easter or a Valentine, you know, the gifting products or the beauty products, will you will see that those that, that will spike. But it, it depends on what you want to do. You want to work with the seasonal products or you want to work with the, the products which sell, uh, you know, all the 12 months throughout the year. Then what we have done, now this is interesting. We put, we, we put together 10 products which we think will help you to, to grow your sales on TikTok. So first, so this is the last product, uh, which is the number 10, uh, where what we are saying that if you sell this product, um, it's perfect for the Mother's Day, right? Because, we, because this is a gifting product. It's not just a spices. We see that it's a gifting product and people are generating a good number of uh, sales um, by taking the advantage of Mother's Day event as well. So here uh, at the end of the webinar, we will share this deck as well. So we will know that why, why we are recommending this because you can create a unique content from this. You can also create a, a unique cocktail as well for you. And then uh, you tell her your story. You know, have a is all about story. Then this is another very interesting product and we think this is perfect for TikTok demographic because uh, what you will find that the, the, the Zen Z, the generation who is uh, most of the time available on uh, uh, TikTok, they are you know, either students uh, or they, and they always tech, uh, you know, care about their fitness. So this gives them an extra boost saying that, okay, a product like this can also help uh, then to to get a pure oxygen, you know, healthy and and stay healthy. And again, there are examples that some well known celebrities have, are using it. So so you know they can get influence if you come up with a really really creative, entertaining video. Then uh, you will find the chocolates again. This is an established category on uh, on a TikTok, and again, there are reasons there why we think you should do it. But what we what you will find that every every four lives you will find one live video for for uh, you know the confectionery's chocolates. So uh, again, no brainer for you to consider selling this product. Um, fashion, as I mentioned it to you, fashion and beauty are the uh, top categories and again if you look at the price points are very very competitive so again you should consider selling these products as well um again okay, another gifting product uh, you know for the for the spices these are the american spice so again uh, helps you to uh, stand out uh, against the, the competition because these are not uh, the normal spices which is available uh, then if someone is uh, into the gaming or also in the PC building, right? Because again, uh, this this there is a big thing on a, on a TikTok. So you can actually we have a huge range of accessories which can be sold as well uh, on a TikTok. So there is information available, uh, but do check this out. That you know there is a huge range available from the supplier uh, one seven four. The number four. Uh, this is a. Uh, uh, again, a mini wand, uh, which is which is silver jewelry. It comes with the gift sets, perfect for the gifting. And you know, when we look at this product, you can see that that if it's been presented nicely, but with the right content, right video, product like this, and the price point is also very competitive, which is under tenner, you can actually generate a good sales out of it. Number three is. Uh, is the is the doormat right? Uh, we when we see this, we th sometimes we think, can we sell this product? But you know, you'll be surprised that you will find so many videos around people cleaning their you know dirty mats, or they are you know, and and then how they do it, what are the things they they do it. So product like this, this is a washable doormat. Again, the price point is quite competitive as well. They offer a free delivery as well. So you know, especially. I personally think that if you if you present the right video with the with the entertaining content, you can generate a good good sales out of it. Number two 
is here. We are actually showcasing the supplier 149, I mean 0049, where they have quite a few products which are demonstrable products. Now, when you see these products, you may find that you are using these products in your home anyway, right? But the interesting thing here is that all these products, the price points are very, very competitive. What, you know, you may actually notice that every time when I'm mentioning about any pro product, I always talk about the price because what we know that on a TikTok, if your product priced well, and if the product price is under 30 pound, you have a very good chance to get a quick order, right? And whatever the products have been presented here, they are fitting into that criteria. So again, you know, our commercial director, Matt Franklin, actually curate the list for our sellers on a daily basis, on a weekly basis, and make sure they get the right products so they can make more profit. And the last one is our supplier, 126. Now this supplier has over 10,000 products and they are specialized in the watches, in the domestic appliances, they have, uh, they have the exclusive brand called Domestic King as well. Uh, and they also sell under that brand quite a few kitchen appliances as well. Now, if you see the price point for these products as well, they are very, very competitive. So again, the point here we are making is that you have access to some of the top trending products on TikTok and you can take the advantage of it. It's just, it, it does require a bit of research and that research, we have done it for you. And we do this for our customers uh, on a weekly basis. Now, what are the key benefits uh, you get when you work with TikTok Shop and Avisa together? So there are five areas where we can uh, help you. Uh, the first one is we provide the full account management service. So what does that mean that if you subscribe for Avisam Business or Guru Package, then we'll help you to onboard on Avisam. TikTok will also help you to optimize your listings as well and, and also guide you that how you can become successful uh, on TikTok uh, by giving you the access to our seller community as well. Another biggest advantage you will get is the commission. So the normally the TikTok will charge 5% uh, if you open an account, but if you actually uh, use the link what we have shared with you, that will give you uh, advantage of uh, get a further discount on the on the commission what they charge. So it will be just 1.8% for the first three months. Also, your account will be eligible for a special discount, special vouchers uh, for on a product promotion and also on a shipping as well. Um, you will also get access to the marketing opportunities, such as uh, uh, you know the Easter event or the or the payday event. So you will get the chance to participate into those kind of events, uh, and that will lead to the uh, more sales. And the last one is is that whenever there is a big event is happening at TikTok uh, Academy as well uh, at the head office. We will invite you to come with us so you can get a first hand experience how the influencers, how the sellers are, are making most out of uh, TikTok. Okay, and that leads us to the last section, which is QA. So, guys, we have completed 42 slides just under 47 minutes. So, now I'm just going to enable the chat. So, some of you can start asking the questions here. Okay, can you all now, can you all see the chat? Any questions you have, we can ask. We are in the process of establishing. Can't. Yeah, makes sense, Adam. So what we can do, um, we can actually organize a call with our uh, strategy manager, you know, the, our customer success manager, Adam, who can get in touch with you and and discuss that, you know, how 
you can contact us and and we can understand that what didn't work and how we can make sure that it works for you so why don't you send an email to support at avasam.com and we can schedule a call and make sure that this time the strategy works for you phil is saying that um is there going to be replay yes there will be replay available uh and we will email it to you uh for a sure that is saying what video app is the best for tiktok so i think um, to to film to film just using your um uh, we find we find i'm sorry for the um the other smartphone lovers but uh like androids and stuff like that but we do find the best filming does come from iPhones but if you have a really good high quality camera on your um your other uh phone that should be fine but in terms of editing a lot of creators use CapCut but you can also edit within the TikTok app as well i hope that answered the question thank you uh am i is asking do have some supplier provide samples of the pro- uh, products um the answer is no emma uh unfortunately you need to purchase the product but i think it is a good exercise for you to do so you know that when you buy a product uh, and when you receive a sample for yourself see that what the packaging is you can do the open box exercise uh, as well and that will help you uh to actually replicate um uh you know your experience with your customers uh talko is asking is this available for the us market so our products from the suppliers are available for the us market but currently have some integration is with the tiktok is not available for us unfortunately we are working on it right they have some uh some legal uh questions legal reasons that's why it's not available but we are working towards it so hopefully that will be available uh in the coming months but the products are available so you can source the products and you can start selling it but unfortunately that experience is once the order comes you need to import the orders am i is asking uh i think then for how come take talk does not allow some products okay yeah so there are some products which is not allowed to sell on tiktok because of the brand restrictions or because the nature of the products certain products either tiktok themselves don't allow or some products the brand themselves do not allow us to sell because they are selling themselves or because they do not have the rights to sell the products hence to to protect your account we are not Uh, we are we are not allowing the uh, that products to be available on tiktok peter i'm in the uk what's the delivery times from amazon so the delivery time a uh, very good question so i mentioned earlier that all of our suppliers are based in the uk uh we we try to um, encourage our suppliers to deliver the goods within 2 uh, to 3 uh, working days and they dispatch the goods i would say 80% of the time they dispatch the goods within 24 hours our customer service team always works proactively so that also gives you an advantage that if you need any help you can reach out to us either via live chat or by raising a ticket and someone will there to answer am i is asking will you send send round the slides afterwards yes we will um definitely vick is saying okay will this event available to watch over yes wake you will get access to this uh, you can know, replay as well right most of the products in the top 10 we are not allowed to list because of the food and drink restrictions i have requested this information but not been provided this so ryan uh, again a very good question food and drink category is a very restricted category this is a new category which tiktok has just started allowing the non brand owners to sell it we have a contact now available at tiktok and they have assured us they are going to help us to unlock any restrictions our sellers are having so my request to you again ryan if you reach out to your current contact at avasam and re- give a reference to this particular discussion they will definitely help you out uh because we have now direct access to the category manager for the food food and drink category Phil is saying, please, can you put the link for the video app uh, in the chat? I did that. Okay, okay. that's fine. Am I saying I'm due for a major surgery very soon? Can I, can you get help 
on how to list the products and connect our sound mixer and how to navigate. Yes, we can do that. So there are um, videos available on help.aversum.com. But if you are if you still need further help, Emma, uh, just send the email to support at aversum.com and we can actually organize a personalized demo where someone can go through with you in detail. Phil is asking, please, can you put the link? Okay, I think video app, it's been covered. Okay, can we buy in bulk on Avisam? Yes, you can buy in bulk in Avisam as well. Ryan is asking, there are not many products on Avisam we can put on TikTok. There are lots of products on TikTok shop which are being drop shipped from China at very low price, which Avisam won't be able to compete with. We need more gadgets on the Avisam platform as this is one of the best market, but the price on Amazon cannot compete to other sellers already on TikTok. Okay, so, so Ryan, I think it's a very good point. Um, so customers are very smart. They know that from where the inventory is coming from. So when they see that the inventory is coming from China, uh, you know, they think twice while they're making a purchase. So my suggestion is that you know, it's not always about the price um, on, on TikTok. If your content is good, if, if it is entertaining, if it is engaging, then customer will buy uh, from you. Now, you are right that the, some of the price, what we, I mean, we always work on getting the competitive price from the seller, but when you see that the prices are not competitive, um, then the reason is because the, the, when the, the stock is local, uh, the goods is sitting in the local warehouse, UK warehouse, where we the price point will not be uh, as competitive as, as China. Uh, I'm really sorry, but look, if any special area where you need help, again, reach out to us. We'll, we'll work hard and we'll try to find a solution for you. Um, just to add to that, just I know um, doing a lot of the lives and things like that, like a lot of people are kind of deterred from ordering from uh, drop, uh, drop shipping from China only because it takes forever and a day for their products to get to them as well. And sometimes there's those hidden costs as well. So um, especially if you're like a UK based uh, supplier, or et cetera, warehouse, if you can even incorporate that into your messaging on your lives, that's going to help boost your sales quite a bit. Amazing. Now, uh, the next question Lillian is asking, can I actually mix and match the products? Yeah, of course you can do that. You can add your own products. Also, you can add the products from Avasam as well, and it won't break the automation. Don't worry. It's been taken care and, and it works really fine. So you'll be fine with that. So Lillian is asking, can I connect TikTok seller accounts with AliExpress? No, do not do that. If you do that, your account will get banned. Uh, we drop shipping from cross country is not allowed on TikTok. So please, please, please don't do that. Now, the, and this is why, why I mentioned to Ryan that when he's saying that he sees the China inventory, those are the global sellers. And some of the global sellers are allowed currently, but UK sellers to getting the inventory from China is not allowed. So don't, don't do that. Otherwise you will see your account will get banned. Phil, I'm already on TikTok and her products violation for listing branded products, even though I have authorization note. To, okay. You're also before selling those products, otherwise you might get a violation. So, 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 you know, it's quite common, Phil. If you have an authorization as well, sometimes you do get a violation notice. Uh, but what you need to do simply just go back to raise a ticket, talk to them and ask them, uh, that you know what your situation is, and then they uplift it. We see this day in, day out with number of our customers, and we don't see any major issue with it. Uh, Peter, would TikTok allow uh, me to dropship from Amazon? Yes, 100% uh, Peter, uh, dropshipping is allowed uh, using Amazon. Uh, as I said, the cross country dropshipping is not allowed, but sourcing the inventory from the local supplier and dropshipping it, uh, why Avisam on a TikTok, not an issue at all. Suleiman is asking, apart from Avisam, which other dropshipper can I add to my TikTok seller account? 
I don't know, Suleiman, that question uh, because uh, we don't know that, you know, other dropshippers from where their inventory is coming from. We know for a fact that majority of them do not have a local inventory. Hence, uh, unfortunately, I don't have an answer on that. Can you reserve the stock on Avisa? Well, unfortunately not. Uh, you cannot reserve the stock. But if you come up with your, a specific marketing plan and if you have a specific strategy, we can have a discussion with a supplier and say that you are going to work on a spe special promotion and you would like them to support you. We can have that discussion. Again, you can raise a ticket with support at avisam.com and we'll look into it. Thank you for answering the questions. Uh, yeah, Emma, no problem. Uh, we'd love to do that. Quasi is saying some of your suppliers I see are from outside the UK. Are we okay to sell them? No, Quasi. So you need to select the filter, uh, the products which are eligible to, to sell on uh, TikTok, only those suppliers. So when you see the suppliers from US or from Netherlands or from India or any other parts of the world, do not actually list those products. Otherwise, your account can get flagged. Okay, Ryan is saying, please, can you get more gadgets, products, and do products? These products aren't enough. Okay, I hear you, Ryan. We'll definitely work on it, and we'll see that how we can solve this uh, issue as well for you, right? Okay. There are questions. Uh, I think there are the same questions being referred as well on the question and answer as well. Carol is asking, can anyone start on TikTok? Do I have to do videos to seek uh, or can I use just like eBay? Carol, yes, you can use also like eBay as well, right? But do not expect wonders, right? This is a video platform. This is an entertainment platform. So we do recommend don't just use like eBay, uh, but you can use that, right? So if you want to grow your sales, then always consider you you do actually ask, uh, you, you do add videos as well. Okay. Uh, okay, Ryan is saying two products are best. Thank you for the heads up. Uh, we'll definitely work on it. All right. So guys, I think that takes us to the end of this uh, webinar. We'd love to talk to you, all of you. You know, I hope you have found this webinar insightful. We genuinely enjoyed it. Uh, and, you know, what we decided to do this uh, every month. So every month we'll come up with the new and new uh, ways to support you, help you, so you can generate more sales. Uh, so once again, guys, thank you. Thank you for your support. Thank you for all your help. And yeah, excited. Any help you need in this TikTok uh, journey, um, you know, we from Amazon here to help you, you know, um, and, and see you successful. Uh, thank you. Thank you once again. Vanessa. Thank you guys. It was lovely to chat with you today. Cheers. Thank you. Uh, thank you guys. Thank you. Bye. Bye.